Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Praise the Lord. Dear friends, uh, today's Word of God um, is a command uh, and a commission to all of us. It's in Gospel of John chapter 21 verse uh, 19b. After this he said to him, follow me. Peter first heard this word when he had experienced the miracle catch and then uh, Jesus commanded him uh, to follow and he followed three years. However, at the end of the three years, uh, um, Peter could not be faithful because of the pressure moments and which we all have. Not to blame uh, Peter when occasions arise, when there are pressure points uh, in our life, we don't know how we would respond or react uh, and that happened to Peter and uh, he feels guilty, he feels ashamed and he has not yet been restored after the resurrection. He saw the resurrection uh, event uh, two times uh, and then uh, this is the third time Jesus appearing uh, to him and now uh, he's being restored and after his restoration he's again given the same command follow me and uh, to all of us um, we have gone astray we have those moments where we did not follow Jesus as we would love to, as we would l like to. Uh, and uh, Jesus is telling again to us, uh, follow me. And uh, following Jesus um, gives you purpose, uh, gives you reason to live, and gives you meaning to your life. Uh, um, um, people um, who follow uh, other people, other leaders, celebrities, sports stars, they end up being uh, despair, depressed and in despair. Uh, however, if you follow Jesus, uh, you have that uh, joy, the peace that not the world uh, uh, can give uh, and it cannot take. Uh, and you'll experience um, that courage to live your life to the full. And let's pray that uh, we also uh, follow Jesus uh, closely, not from far, but very closely. Uh, may this word of God help you. The Lord be with you, with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen.